Emerging markets, you mentioned them earlier on. Let's talk just a little bit about China. Everybody seems to be so worried, and China itself, about that slowdown to perhaps below 7.5% of GDP. Now tell us, of course, a lot of the European past growth and even American past growth came from the engine of China. China going down, emerging markets following, does it make any difference to where the economies stand in Europe and the US? Really? Well, one of the interesting aspects of this uh, slowdown in Asia and emerging markets is, um, is a less energy intensive consumption. So we're seeing prices of commodities coming down, price of energy, oil, gas, and this is good for a more balanced growth. Uh, in terms of trade improvements in, in Europe and in the US. So this slowdown, if it remains as, as it looks like, is not necessarily bad for the sustainability of the recovery. Of course, if China is not able to, to stop the slowdown and we are going to hard landing, that's going to be, that's going to be worse, of course. Um, but I think the China has the resources, you know, huge reserves, to try to, to stabilize the situation over the next one or two years. Then over the long term, there are more fundamental issues that they have to tackle in a transition to a market economy, a really market economy.